Okay, hello, everybody. It's back on Hellwiki, and, um, I got a request, um, so I'm going to be showing you how to, um, or it was the request of how to record the, um, Roller Coaster Tycoon 3 gameplay without using, like, Cam Studio and Hypercam and crap like that. So, what you want to do is press Control, Shift, and Zero, and this will pop up. So on this, you can see where it says new route right here. Click that right there. And this whole thing pops up, okay? Let me drag this up here in the middle. Okay, so um, there's a bunch of buttons where I'll start from the S. Okay, so the S is where your button starts. And then you press F every frame you want. So. What you're going to do is press um, S where you want to start, so S. So then when you move it around, you can see this little thing right here. That's where your camera is, right there. And it shows, like, where you're moving it. So then press F whenever you want a new frame. F again, F, F. Now if you press E and scroll around... Obviously, you can make it longer and make it look better. Now, you have to practice this a little bit for the motion. Some of my videos are bad with the motion. So then, you can um, press solo play or just play. So, over here, there's a pause and a play button over here. So just press play. It'll show you on this little tiny screen of what's happening in this little red bar right here it um if you click it up to a thing it goes faster as you can see and you can go extremely fast so when you press solo play over in this it's insert recalc control solo play a new route so press solo play okay you can see it's horrible and then this blue one i'm not really sure what it does but Not really a difference, but, um, anyways, so if it's going too slow like this, and you press solo play, it's going way too slow, you can press escape, and then it says this, just press X, and then you can, it stops the whole thing, and then you can speed it up, and it plays it. And then, whenever you want to do it, it does take a long time, it could take up to like 10 or 20 minutes depending how long it is and how many frames you used. Um, if something's speeding up, the frames will go quicker. And then you just press the record button over here in front of the checkoff buttons. Um, I checked that off and it doesn't really do anything. But you just press record and it'll go really slow. Like it'll go frame by frame. And it'll take, for this one, probably three or four minutes. And, um... That's pretty much it, yeah. And then when you press record, you go into your documents. Let me show you where to find it. Okay, so... You go into... Start... Documents. And then you go to... RCT3... Or, I'm sorry. Go to your documents, and then go to your videos. Which, I'm not sure where they are, but... Mine would be in videos or right here in the libraries. Well, if you have like a new computer like mine, it'd be in um, libraries and go to my videos. And then you click on the folder for Roller Coaster Token 3, and here's one of my videos. After you record it, it pretty much just saves it. But the problem you have to do, see it was breaking down there. The problem with this is whenever, um, after the, you can see the gameplay will go really slow after you start recording something. It's that it means it's still recording, so it'll go like this. Like whenever you try to scroll in, it'll go really slow, like that. But that because it's still recording, so that's how you get um pops or rotting on the slides, like on my video, where I'm riding on the slide. You just click the um test, and then you can ride it. But and then it shows all this, like the buttons. And when you're doing the original thing, it doesn't show you I'm um, doing that. And that's pretty much it to it. And after, and it shows all the way out when you exit, so when I'm doing this, 
it shows all this when you're saving everything, and when you're exiting out of the thing, and after you record it, it you don't really need to save your route. It doesn't really do anything. Well, it saves your route, but it automatically saves it in the computer. And that's pretty much it. And, uh, so check out my channel for the green screen test. I'll be making a video on that soon. And also, there's the Sea Rocks Water Park, which I'll be making number two soon. And that's what I use. I use the, um, that video. It comes in a lot better quality, like this one right here. This one just got, like, it, the other ones had bad quality. See, this is HD. Because I use Windows Movie Maker. My Movie Editor Pro um, kind of doesn't do that. So, that's pretty much it for this tutorial. And, um, also, there's a request to by, um, the Chris Guy. Um, that's who requested my video. And, hope you enjoyed. I hope this helps. Um, so, yeah. See ya.